Beginning in the final decade of the last century and early 2000s, blue jets, blue starters, and gigantic jets have been somewhat adequately studied and identified as high-altitude upward-traveling electric discharge or a form of lightning. Along with the jets, different types of sprites, elves, trolls, pixies, ghosts, and gnomes have been identified and cataloged. Also, most everyone, including maybe even some astrophysicists, astronomers, and cosmologists, would be unaware of a special class of plasma phenomena called Peratt instabilities. Dr. Anthony Peratt, when he was doing classified research at Los Alamos National Laboratories, and later as co-director of that organization, identified some very specific plasma forms that happen in a sequence as a high energy discharge breakdown, and these were named after him. We never see these forms in the sky nowadays, but the ancient people living at the end of the Golden Age certainly did. We can know this with a high degree of certainty because they collectively spent thousands of hours in shielded locations, laboriously yet faithfully carving these unique forms into the thousands of petrographs that we find around the Northern Hemisphere. The interplanetary discharge to the southern hemisphere, netherworld of Earth, gave off ionizing synchrotron radiation, which alters the integrity of the human genome and can be lethal at some level. If this sounds unfamiliar, even preposterous, it is because establishment academic scientism is in denial of what really happened in the ancient times and have constructed a modern mythology that has infected every discipline except those that are constantly and ineluctably tested by reality, like chemistry and engineering.